I am continuing to look like a potato, but it's nine o'clock. We don't need chains. We can dr we can drive. I was wondering what was going on with the mustache there. To Mount High today, so let's shower, get packed, and get this show in room. Good morning, Bay. You sexual thing. How are we doing? I hope she's going to treat me well today. There, there, and tires. Godspeed. We are waiting for Best Buy to open in approximately five minutes. As soon as it opens, I can get one of them phone things that you'd like to stick to here, and then I can stick it to it, and then just like use my phone as a GPS, and then an in-car charger and aux cord. Sweet. I think I have to get used to parking this elephant every day. So far, so good. Well, I've obtained two of the objects that I need. Four foot car charge cable for my Mophie case, and then an in-car car charger. Now, I'm looking for the phone mount. Hey, we found it, car electronics. Where do we need? Hey, this is what we need. The vehicle mount. Perfect. Well, to say I'm supposed to be going snowboarding, I am, whoa, bouncing all over the place. I am royally in the middle of the California desert right now. Like, straight up cactuses everywhere and all that sort of shit. I'll try and flip the camera on and see if you can check it out. Oh, would you look at this? This is my totally not straight driving rig setup. So, right now I'm about 40 minutes away, hopefully heading in the right direction. GPS, do not fail me now. And, uh, oh, look, there's mountains in the background, dude. That could be where we're going. So uh, anyway, I need my GPS back. Get the fuck out of here. Literally driving in the middle of nowhere, aiming towards them hills. The GPS says it's up ahead of me, so fingers crossed, it's sending me in the right direction. I have been jamming, chilling to some tunes, driving at 50 miles, 55, 55, 60 miles per hour. That's the speed limit. And uh, it's been awesome. Good drive so far, really like it. Um, not had much traffic or anything like that at the time I set off. Hopefully I can make it there in time to actually get a lesson in if I can then sweet if I can't then I'm basically just gonna be like yeah I could totally snowboard and then just go and die on the on the slope so fingers crossed we can get there in time for the lesson at one o'clock oh boy we're in the thick of it now we up in the mountains we up in the in the, in the glaciers maybe not exactly glaciers but look at this man there's snow there's ice there's actually people that I've not seen anyone in like two hours driving on these roads but I have made it to a snowy part I've got about 10 minutes left until I get there so fingers crossed again I still make it in time it's just so beautiful well I made it and I made it to the right place bunch of people here pretty sick some woman just got stuck in a car already so hopefully I'm gonna get out just fine if I don't stay until it gets too cold later on but there is ice everywhere I am totally gonna slip and fall and die we made it boys we made it Oh yeah, right, got my ticket, gonna go get the rentals now, and then um, one o'clock, we begin. Genuinely so stoked, I've seen like little kids just like fucking bombing it down the mountain, I'm like, I wanna be able to do that. <laughs> well, that was the first time he put putting on boots. Pretty damn comfy. And this guy right here recognised me from no. doing videos, so he's gonna see me fail. I am having some hella bad luck with credit cards, mate. I fucking lost mine. Thank the fucks, I found my snowboard, uh, not my snowboard, my credit card, but uh, finally, made it to here, gonna go and use the toilet real quick. And then once I'm done with that, we start the lessons. Like my helmet? <laughs> yeah, it looks so good. Mate, everyone is falling over left, right and centre and I intend to do so as well. I trust this guy. Are you a pro? No. <laughs> I trust this guy. I'm going to follow him the entire way down and hopefully not die. This is fucking awesome. Look at the steepness of them. Holy shit. Yeah, I'll stick with this for now, thank you very much. That is fucking insane. Well, we bet an I fall first. <laughs> so far, so good. Haven't fallen over just yet. Come on. Like this guy. There you go. Come on, you got this, dude. Uh, it's fun. Enjoy it. Um, we're about to go on the ski lift now, so wish me luck. Well, we're going to try the big boy slope now. Hopefully, not going to fall like this person did, that person did, that person did, and that person did. So I don't think the odds are really in my favor, but we'll see how this goes. Yeah, <laughs> oh yeah, this is awesome. I'm on my third run now. Uh, got this class done, it was really good. Definitely learned a lot. I would definitely advise people doing it. It was like $90 uh, and when I next come back, I get my pass to lift for free. So hopefully we come back tomorrow and I do level two, which should be pretty damn sweet. But check it out. This is fucking sweet. Like randomly yesterday was just like, 
feel like going snowboarding. And today I was like, let's go snowboarding. So there I am, snowboarding. Science. For the record, there is no handle on this. You kind of just sit on it and hope you don't fall. And you hold onto your snowboard with one foot. It just sits there while you rest it like that. So this is me shredding the gnar, watching some peeps fall over. Has he got this? 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 Oh, she fell. How do you felt? Double kill. Bruh, ripped my ankle. God damn, my ankles are on fire, but that was so much fun. Fucking hell. Excuse my language. That was actually so much fun, but now I need to get some food, some water, energy in me, and hit the slopes again, because I'm getting better and better and better, and I want to get really damn good. Oh my God, this is absolutely heaven right now. Look at the steam coming off my hands. Jesus. That was such a good day on the slopes. Like, it's been so fucking good. Definitely gonna come back tomorrow. It's four o'clock now. I've been snowboarding for three hours. But yeah, it takes your toll on your ankles, that's for sure. No one warned me of that fact. That is so crazy. My phone is at 50% battery. And because of the cold, it's eating away at my battery. And my phone just keeps randomly turning off. So, got a little snack. Get them calories back inside me. And go and hit the slopes again. I just had a bath, yes, a bath. Whoa, I caught a bit of sun today. Look how red my face is. Um, I had a bath, and now I'm gonna stream some CSGO Lotto. Cause I always play CSGO Lotto, like a shitload, but no one ever sees it because, like I'll either stream it and never put it in the vlog or whatever reason, but gonna stream it. Oh shit. Holy shit, it's getting cold. I don't even know if you can see that. Look how busy it is still. Four o'clock in the afternoon and it's still rammed. So this is like the big, big slope that everyone goes on, which, is it, is it stopped? Oh no, it's still going. And this is the one that I'm on, like the smaller one. And I'm doing this one at the moment. I go up to the top of it, ride down, up to the top of it, ride down. But then there's one, if you get so pro, you take over here. Look how steep that is. Holy shit. People bomb down it and look like they're about to die. My phone battery was on 75%. It's now on 25. This is how badly the cold weather just fucks with your battery. So, look like I got the spare Mofa in the back, so I could just charge it up, but... Man, I cannot wait to come back here with a GoPro. So, either Tuesday or Wednesday I'm gonna come back, but look forward to come back with a GoPro and uh, just just own it up, like the GoPro on the stick. I could do it on the helmet, but it'll just, I think the footage would be crap. So, I'm gonna GoPro with a stick, like a selfie stick, and just try and bomb it down and see how it goes. Well, I can make it down the mountain pretty successfully. And I've only done about five runs and a one and a half hour lesson. Don't want to run him over. I am massively enjoying this. And that was it, final run of the day. Absolutely awesome. Probably got about 10 runs in. Right ankle is absolutely killing me. But my, oh my, that was an awesome day. Well, my first day on Mountain High was absolutely epic. Definitely, definitely coming back. It's quite a far drive away. I actually did it in an hour and a half, not two hours, but way worth it. Just, it was phenomenal. Come on, it's icicles, I had to steal one. I'm gonna have to impale. What is it, what was that? Until dawn. Until dawn shit going down. The size of this one, really? Fucking hell. Mate, it's an ice spear. I couldn't help it, I found more, I have an idea. Ooh. Took that whole thing off. Watch my hand get stuck to it. Ready? It's like I'm smashing windows back here. Run. Okay, that's the best way to get down this path, which is just made of ice. Oh, I'll get out of the way. <laughs> that is so cheating. I definitely made the right decision with getting a 4x4 four four because this is just ice a car park. Look at that. Oh, no. Oh, no. You would think, think, oh my god, I'm gonna die. You would have potentially thought, whoa! Look at that sunset, that is beautiful. I'm gonna see that on the drive home the entire way. But uh, yeah, if I would end up going like a, a Mustang or a sports car or something like that, it would have just been a terrible, terrible idea. I look like a nuke's just gone on it off in the background. That is, oh, someone fell. That is so fucking nice. Not even kidding, just over there putting all my stuff away. Look at the sky. It is on fire. This is no colour filter effect. Holy shit, this is absolutely beautiful. Holy shit, the roads are so fucking icy. I'm gonna die one way or another here, I'm guessing. So let's just pray for the best. It says exit this way, so I'm just gonna follow wherever the hell it's telling me to go. Boop. Warning, 30 minute delay ahead. I was like, what the fuck has happened? I was like, oh yeah, I'm coming into LA. So unfortunately, 
Um, yeah, I'm stuck in this queue. Hour and 50 minute drive home from El Snowboarding. My legs are killing me from one, snowboarding, and two, non-stop. Are you beeping at me for you, little shit? Keys are out. Um, and non-stop. Uh, stopping and starting the accelerator. There is brake it. Oh my god, I don't know what I've done for. Either way, I don't need Ubers to come and get me groceries anymore, so I'm just getting some milk, some drinks, and whatever the fuck I need. Because <sighs> I'm going to go and get in the bath and die. Well, I decided that I need to have better snacks in my house, so I decided bread, Philadelphia, and crisps. Crisp boys. That is what I'm going to survive off for the next month in Los Angeles. Ripperoni boys, there's a car park there, so we're most likely going to hit it. Kid did me good. I'm proud. Luckily, I didn't take out Captain Sparkles in his Fiat 5. Yay! I'm joking, it's just that that's a very female car, and I love that Captain Sparkles got one of them. Everyone, go and tweet Captain Sparkles saying, that's a nice car you've got there. Does it come with a hairdryer? Well, would you look at that? I've only just got back from snowboarding and I just won myself more knives. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. See us go to I love you. Look at that. Would you just look at that? Just won myself two more knives. Yeah. Huh, would you look at that? I'm gambling again. This is probably gonna be the last knife gamble of the night. Can we start with victory or lo uh, okay. Or lost, I guess. <gasps> I crave a turn. Can I please win my knives back? Yay! I did it! I finally won my knives back. I am now even. I am Steven. I am happy because I've never had a fade factory name. Sweet! Oh, I only just realized how absolutely creepy them Santa Cokes are. Hello there. I just had a bath. Yes, a bath. Whoa, I caught a bit of sun today. Look how red my face is. Um, I had a bath and now I'm gonna stream some CSGO Lotto because I always play CSGO Lotto like a shitload. But no one ever sees it because like, I'll either stream it and never put it in the vlog or whatever reason, but going to stream it. Oh, shit. Ladies and gentlemen, me and Josh OG, we're throwing down. I'm going to click accept. And this is a $600 bet. Now, I'm, for, for some reason, I'm just not expecting to win this at all because you didn't let me go CT. But Josh lost so many times tonight that I'm letting him take this butterfly. I, you can have it this, Josh. You can have this. Everyone say hello to YouTube. <laughs> I just, just got wrecked. Well, I got done streaming and unfortunately, to my surprise again, my computer is taking a potato shit on me. I'm trying to work with Razor getting a new one sorted out, but look at my knees. Oh, they're all so bruised. I think I've got a bruised ass as well. I don't think this knee is as bad. Eh, uh, no, it's not as bad. I fucking hit the, 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 the what? I basically just hit the ground way too hard when I was skiing and shit just went completely wrong, but do you know what fixes? her knees, okay? I'm gonna show you. Step one, we need the base. Step two, we need the cream. Then we need the filler. Oh yeah. This is actually like the hardest decision. I'm actually so happy that I got some sun. You want, I have no idea how much I wanna just get out of the apartment, go get a suntan and just be outdoors, but there's never really much to do in it like you just get stuck in traffic. So you have to drive two hours out of the way to then go snowboarding, which was so worth it. Okay, balls do up. I didn't know what step this was, so I just put it on instead. Okay, now this step is the most important step, hence the stand. You can't mess this step up, it's the most important. You have to delicately, delicately, place it on top, like so. Make sure it's on perfectly. Perfectly. Now you just kick back, chill out, get all cuddly and chilled, put some Netflix on, and you just go. Mm. But nonetheless, guys, thank you so much for watching my videos. I know I've been always known as the gaming guy, but it's so awesome just to be bumping into people who recognize me from my vlogs, who love tuning in, and I just know that none of this would have been possible without you guys. So from the bottom of my heart, I really cannot thank you enough because I never thought in my life I'd ever get the opportunity to just be in, in L.A., be able to just go and rent a 4x4 four four and then go and learn how to snowboard in a day. These are the opportunities that I could only ever dream of when I was younger and thanks to you guys you've made it all possible. So honestly, thank you so damn much. There isn't a day that goes by without me being thankful for where I am in life because of you guys. So I appreciate it an unfathomable amount. 
I just love unpanable. That word is amazing. But as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you click that like button. Let me know you enjoy the video. Subscribe every day. I make a new video for your faces of me doing random stuff. Could be snowboarding, could be going on trips to Russia, could be whatever the hell randomly occurs in my life because this is the life of Tom. It's the life of me and uh, hopefully you'll uh, subscribe and enjoy it. And if you want, be awesome. Share it with your friends on Facebook or Twitter and be like, check out this guy's life. He does random shit. Don't say that. They might not. They, you know what? Just, just say that. He does random shit. I'm fine with that. That's exactly how it is. But honestly, thanks for everything, guys. I love you all. I'm going to bed. It's one o'clock in the morning and... Goodbye to your faces.